Yo, what's good, people? Welcome back to the Sadly Relatable Podcast. We back, baby. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Guys, shut up for a second. It's been one year officially today. So not, not today, today, but the day that you we see this. Technically, not the day that they see it either. It's so we're posting on Sunday, the fifth of trauma. December. But we posted our first episode on the 6th of December last year. What the hell? Literally in a whole year. We were nowhere near the goal we set. <laughs> yeah. I'm joking. Is that what you're but, thinking about? No, one life's not. I'm, I'm so gassed. I'm not, I didn't think I'd be this committed to something yeah. ever in my life. Yeah, there's a part of me that was like, will we really even make it to a year? Like, I was like... It I doesn't know, feel mad. like a year. It feels like we just started yesterday. Yeah. And what's mad as well is it's not the right amount of number of episodes because obviously we missed some weeks. Yeah. But it's literally been a year, if yeah. that makes sense. And um, I don't you? know, it's crazy. I think we wanted to do something special, but we got so caught up in life that we didn't even realise it was a year episode until today. I, you realised? How did you realise? Yeah, I was just like, I was looking at the date and I was like, wait a minute. And then I had a Snapchat memory come up of when oh, we first it? filmed, when we first set up. And I was like... Wait, so we first filmed... To- no, today? no, it was the day before, and then I forgot about it and then remembered again today. Oh, today's. that's so cool. Yeah. yeah, so guys, thank you so much. What? Sorry, by the way, I know it might be annoying when my hair sticks out at the no back. No one cares do you about find, your hair. Do you? do you find it annoying when you're editing and my hair's sticking out I'm at not the looking back? At you, looking at me. I know. <laughs> um, thank you so much, guys. We always talk about how much we love you, how much we appreciate you guys. And I feel like I don't need to emphasize that, but emphasize? Emphasize that, but I do just want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts. If you've been here from the start, if you've just joined, a week ago if you join halfway through if you join this episode even if you join this episode we, we appreciate you. you we love you did you see everyone spotify um yes yearly i didn't thing? get i didn't get a chance to reply to all of them but i was like this is so sick no there was literally like i there I was so, so many, many DMs. so many my dms are just flooded because i was like all right i was checking i was like oh, i need me reply to a few and then i realized there's so i can't even reply to all of them because there's so, so many we were basically <laughs> um spotify does like a yearly um what is it? A yearly, like, your most watched or your most listened to yeah, podcast. Yeah. And, and it numbers them. We were, like, a lot of people's most listened to podcast. Yeah, that's mad. That's so cute. That is it? so cute. I'm so gassed. Also, that's mad that, like... Spotify sponsor us. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that's mad that, like, it's been a year and then people had their roundup of how, long, how much they've been listening to us. It's so sick. I'm so Aww, gassed. I'm going to cry. <laughs> um, yeah, so what was I saying? I just want to say thank you, guys. I love you. We love you. You guys, I genuinely put down all the good most of the good things that have happened in my life in the last year yeah i put it down to you lot you know what, because like, of all your prayers yeah. and i like genuinely life was really 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 rubbish before I before like the podcast, they came like, along has actually made our life yeah it's a bit weird isn't it no no it's not weird no it's weird that like alhamdulillah this is the thing that like changed things for us yeah mentally yeah mentally like just everything and even if like people, when I say that, I genuinely mean like I put down every good thing that's happened to literally everyone making dirt out yeah. for me. So that's why, guys, you lot hold a very, very special place in my heart. And I hope you guys know in our hearts. I hope you guys know that you're in our prayers, every single one of you. If you're listening to this, if you're watching this right now, you're in our prayers. We we only want happiness, success, goodness for you and your family Amen. and your loved ones. And I pray that all of your dreams come true. Amen. And thank you for making all of ours come true. Yeah, it's actually so mad. I was called. So basically, to, before we get into the episode properly, we are going to do an and a giveaway where we're going to give away some AirPod Pro. Are they the new ones? I don't. Okay, so here it is, right? Sorry. And um, we literally just decided this. We were like, oh my God, it's, a, it's been a year. What are we going to do? Yeah. Like, we've both been very caught up in life. And I know we always use that excuse, but whatever. And <laughs> um, we both been very caught up in life. We're like, what are we going to do? Like, we haven't. You guys know we've been talking about meet and greet. We've been doing this. We've been yeah. doing this, and everything's so delayed. But we've we've slowly like worked the meet and greet. Uh, we've kind of has a date, yeah. yeah. And so, we're and I've figured out how we're gonna do it. We're yeah. just sorting out. So, but I'm saying like the reason that happens is because this isn't our full time job. Yeah, it's very difficult to like do balance as well, everything out. and do as well as we would like for you guys, not yeah. even for us, for you lot. It's like with merch, like we want with everything behind the scenes has been so delayed because of everything else that we've got going on. Yeah. But we're going to get to a point where things start working out, start, yeah. start like actually coming out and, and you can see the progress and see things and opportunities. And yeah. Stuff like that, yeah. So today, sorry, I keep talking That's so much. Right. So today we were like, what can we do? What can we do? And um, we decided we're going to give away some AirPods. So I don't know if they're going to be the pros. They will be the new, they'll be like the new, they won't be the old ones. They'll yeah. be the new ones. The, the newest ones. The newest ones. We're going to give yeah. them away, guys. Um, 
Hopefully by next year it will be like a car. Oh, I thought you meant by like hopefully by next year they'll no, get there. <laughs> hopefully next year we can be like, guys, we're gonna give away a car. Yeah. Inshallah, you watch never you guys. know. Or like ten million. We could AirPods. do it now, but we'd be broke. Could we do it now? Oh, don't know. You're the one that was with Charlotte Tilbury. <laughs> um, oh yeah, we still have we spoke about that. Yeah, we have. And <laughs> um, yeah, so guys, AirPods. Um, so just to be cheeky, because we just want to be cheeky. Yes. Wait, first of all, anyway, guys, comment down below like uh, anything just because it's our one year anniversary yeah and um, also to be cheeky to enter the giveaway we're not going to tell you like do this and do this and do this all you have to do is comment down below we'd appreciate if you were subscribed to us yeah. but even if you don't want to but there's gonna be a certain word they have to comment yeah and we're not going to tell you now it's going to randomly t- come up in the middle of the episode so yeah. all the guys that are watching right now they're like oh man so yeah you if you want to win some airpods then you have to watch this episode and we're going to say also guys Imagine yeah. we forget. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, we just put it on the screen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, <laughs> also, I don't know, actually. People can oh, just go the- to the comments and see what people have put. Oh, damn. Put, put loads of different words. <laughs> damn it, I just realised. <laughs> have to guess which one. <laughs> okay, guys, hit, that's a good idea. No, but then right. they, that person can just copy all them words. More comments for us. Go. <laughs> <laughs> guys, if you find out the words to enter the giveaway, right, don't just put that word. Put, like, other random words as well. Like, do one of the word and then do, like, two. Two more. Do you know what? Actually, no. Do you know who's going to win this giveaway? We're not even going to do that. We want you to talk about your favourite moment in the podcast and then put the word at the end of the, at the end of it. So we're at least picking someone that has they've they've watched they've they've had a moment that they remember that like was yeah. A good do you know what? That's them. a good idea because it's a year, guys. Yeah. Sorry, we've been waffling for the past five ten minutes. Yeah. Right. So tell us your favourite moment on the podcast and tell us when you joined and when you started watching. Yeah. And then say a little word at the end. We'll tell you halfway through the episode what the word and is, and then you'll be entered in the giveaway. Yeah. There and you go. um, good. yeah. Because then the people who are just going to copy the we'll just see who put it first yeah and we'll pick the giveaway winner in the next episode yeah. just because we don't want to be like long I hate it when giveaways take so long yeah, we'll do, we still got a giveaway that we have to yeah, send no, no, out no, but, no no but we'll do that when we do our merch thing okay, okay. do you get so, it yeah inshallah um, so, but yeah anyway jumping into the episode yesterday I yeah. was at an event yeah um, oh I got the photos I need to reply to her she sent me the photos. You know the photos she took? Oh, out of all of us together? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I was at an event. I actually want to just re- remember the exact name of the event so I can... What? Yeah, I was so confused at what that event was. Um, so it was the Upskill Foundation. Yeah. And they're doing a lot to help like the youth in picking careers and doing all this stuff. Okay. Like, they're doing a lot of work. Uh, it's, it's really well. Go check them out. But basically, they had me on as a panelist just to talk about... You didn't tell me. Yeah, it was a bit of a last minute thing. But um, I went on to talk about my career in like social media and like the podcast and stuff like that. And what was cool is when we got there, there was people that were sadly relatable. No. Yeah, it was so oh, cute. I'm so sad. I remember. I remember. I was like, I was sitting at the front row and I uh, waiting to go on. And I was telling my friends that came with me. I was like, ah, oh, I feel because I'm not like to you. Public speaking, I've realized like, I can't do it. I'm not gonna turn my head because <clears> it's gonna annoy me so much. Sorry, guys. Hey, and, carry on. I'm listening. Yeah. So public speaking, I can do it. Sorry, but I'm just my anxiety will kick in. Really? And so I was so stressed and I was anxious. And in my head, I was like, oh, I'd feel a little bit better if I knew that someone here was like a sadly relatable viewer. Yeah. And then literally, as soon as I said that to my friend behind me, the girl next to her was like, I just want to say, I watch your podcast. And and she was so, that's a girl that I FaceTimed you with. She was so nice. Um, Anyway, so. Wait, how many sadly relatable viewers were there? Not not, not a lot. I mean, was was there more than two? Yeah, there was more than two. There was probably like five or more but anyway shout out to you guys we love you <laughs> what was cool was this well not what wasn't cool sorry i'm just jumping in um this is what stressed me out as i went to speak apparently i did well but as soon as i was on stage and you i was speaking nervous? literally i had like a mini panic attack in my like my hands were sweating and i was shaking and i was like trying really? to hold it they, people said How they long didn't did notice you speak? I was up there for like probably an hour, just under an you hour. You were speaking. Not, no, not me. They were, they were asking all of us questions and we take turns answering. How many people were you speaking to? There was about a hundred or just under a hundred, I think. That's something a lot. like that. Or 60. I don't know. I'm not going to lie to you. I can't See, remember. See, I'm such an attention seeker because yeah. I would love that. But the thing that. is, I'm good. Like, remember my school performance? At oh, my school yeah. play? I was up. Maybe it's because I'm more comfortable with the people, but yeah. I'm, I can perform. But when it comes to speaking, because yeah. I feel like I can be articulate, but as soon as I have to, like, there's pressure on me, I start forgetting words. Yeah. I'm like, I'm trying to, like, uh, and then I, I just end up 
repeating the last thing I said, like yeah, trying yeah, to end no, what I'm I get saying. It. That's normal though, but that's just that's normal. Everyone gets nervous. But you know what I noticed happened is whilst that was happening and it asking us questions about the podcast, I was fumbling, fumbling, and at first I was like it was getting bad, but then towards the end I got more comfortable and the topic of mental health come up, oh. and I've noticed as soon as it comes, I'm I think I just because I'm passionate about it, yeah. I was able, I was talking, I was talking about this, what you should do, all this stuff, yeah. like it just came so much more naturally and, and easily. And you're more comfortable. Yeah, yeah, that is really good. I wish I was there. Why? Where was my invite? Are you? you just are such you're so annoying I'm not annoying you never invite me to anything that was a last minute thing I, know, I should invite you I'm not you like never you. invite forgot. me to anything I just forgot sorry do you know why because you're bougie you don't turn up unless you're getting paid no. <laughs> hey that's not true <laughs> no that's not true at all that's actually not true I'm just <laughs> trying um, to make it look bad no that's not true don't say that <laughs> basically um what? I don't want to take away from what you done oh, okay. by so mentioning you did this, but I no, did but this. this, this type now thirty kids have a home to live in. <laughs> no, no, this type. Shut up. Right, go. I don't want to like basically take away from what you're saying, but it ties into what you're saying. Yeah. So when I was doing the Charlotte Tilbury live, yeah. sorry. Well, here we go. I'm, I'm not... joking. Well, I want to know. I want to know. No, I don't want to. No, speak, I actually want to know. Right. No, no, really know. Oh, shut up then. All right, guys. No, she wants to. I know she wants to. No, I don't want to change no, the subject. Can you say it? Okay, so basically, <laughs> um, when I was doing that live, I was so. If you guys don't know, I feel like we speak to them as if they know everything in our lives. Yeah, when they probably so they only might watch, be conf- yeah. and then they don't know what's going on. Uh, if you guys don't know, I done a live, a TikTok shopping live uh, with Charlotte Tilbury, mm-hmm. and. I, all of my TikTok shopping lives have been at home. I've been very comfortable. I've just been like duh, 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 um, on my phone. And then I went into the studio. I went into her office. A, but it was so... Have we spoke about this yet? I, I think we did in the last episode. Did we? Did we? Or was it that episode before the live? Abe, I don't know. I think I heard you speaking about it on the live and I feel like you've done it in the episode. I don't know. We might have spoke about it in the last episode, but did we? I don't know, but tell us I anyway. I think we did. All right, just give us a quick overview anyway. I want to know how you're feeling. Um, quick overview. It was so I was so no- so. Usually, I'd literally do it like this, like a normal live. Yeah. But they literally took my phone. Yeah. Like they connected it to the computers. I had a sound man come up to me, be like, "Hi, introduce himself, put put You've a mic like, on me." Experienced the real thing. So like, what happened <laughs> is this. I'll tell you what happened because I don't actually know if I did speak about it. It's no. gonna be so annoying if I have. Yeah, I don't think you have because I'm. I feel like this is new to me as oh, well. Oh, okay. So <laughs> I walked in. Right. Um, we had to like take a photo to check ourselves. Walked into the Charlotte Tilbury headquarters. Yeah take a photo to like check ourselves in yeah. and then I'm going to post a vlog on TikTok by the way I've got all the footage oh, so sick. make sure you follow me on TikTok and then we were just waiting and then someone took us upstairs into like the waiting area there's like a bar it's all like Charlotte Till it's so it's literally like there was like Vogue covers all on the floor of like makeup she's done because she's a makeup artist yeah. as well she's also a celebrity makeup artist and she has her own brand that's so mad <laughs> And then they were like, okay, we're just going to take you down to the studio. Went down to the studio. Um, there's like a whole team of like cameramen, um, lights, like everything, like production. It's a whole production team. Did you team. feel important? Yeah, I did feel, I felt so important. It's, know, a, it's the only time I've ever felt like I that. Feel, I know it sounds bad, but is it weird that I've always wanted to experience that? No, that but you will. You, not in the, in the point I'm better than people, no, but, but the point is like you're the main person yeah, and everyone's yeah. like, we're going to do this, we're going to work around you, here's your makeup. Yeah, this, well, this. <laughs> and to be fair, no, to be fair, it was so, one life say it's one of the best experiences of my life. That's so That's sick. literally how I felt, um, which is nice because you always, I don't know, it's just nice. You see it and you're like, it's like a, the feeling of being like a celebrity yeah, or something yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah, but which I don't care, no one cares about yeah. it but it's nice to just experience it yeah, for like yeah. a day so went in there and um whatever walked into the studio and then so they had the setup mm-hmm. which is basically like this but just times a thousand in terms of like production team like they had a big screen they had like you know when you're in the news yeah and it has like you know when people do the news and it has like the things yeah yeah to say. so the monitor that tells yeah, you yeah and it has say. writing Did so that, that, that well? wasn't for me that was for charlotte herself saying, i wouldn't be able to do that i'd be like uh, yeah take too long that to wasn't read. for me but it was there <laughs> lights all the makeup was set up and then i looked at that and i was like that's amazing and then right behind that was like um the like beauty area and I had I had one of um, Charlotte Tilbury's like global makeup artists just prep my skin. Her her at name's like Sophia M U A. I I don't know exactly, but I'll find out. I'll put mm-hmm. it in the comment section. So she like prepped my skin. She like just basically done like a little massage and like put in. That's we spoke sick. about the products a bit. She was like, "Do you need this?" I was like, "Yeah, can I get this, please?" In this shade, and then can, can you I add say this? one thing about your that whole life that I was so I was so proud when I saw it because I was like. 
they don't realize that they got you on and you're someone that knows about makeup. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. They could have got any TikTok live and it would have been like they're trying to set, but you were literally sitting there telling her about what this does. Really? You, yeah, I was like, because so, I just remember, you remember you used to do makeup tutorials and all yeah, that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you have the knowledge yeah, exactly. of what to talk about, how it should work, what you should use it for. Exactly. And you look so professional. How long did you watch? I was, I was there for a while. Really? But yeah, well, like, I was so gassed. I was so proud of you. Aww. Anyway, carry on. You just you knew what you were doing. You were talking to her about it. She, looked, she just looked like she was impressed with you. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. So here's the thing, right? It's funny because I haven't spoke about this properly yeah. but so then what happened is I bought her some chocolates and um, I bought her I didn't know what to get her so I got Ferrero Rocher and I got Lindor and I just bought them with me and then they were like okay we're gonna take you up to meet Charlotte now uh, in her dressing room mm. and I was like uh. so I bought the chocolates so we were going through like her headquarters on this floor and then they had to like scan things walked in and there was like a massive office but it was like a comfortable office mm-hmm. and then you go upstairs and it's like her huge dresser so I was literally everyone was there I was like hi like being so nice and I was like walking past with my chocolates I was so nervous Ayub. and then she was like one second she's just getting dressed we're gonna check so she went in she was getting dressed or whatever and then she just brought me in like she was just like just come in and straight away walked in like the most beautiful office eh? it's like something you see out of a movie yeah. the most beautiful office the most beautiful like dressing room it's like everything you imagined it to be yeah. walk in and I'm like oh my god like I'm so nervous and she's just so nice that I just feel like I was speaking to a friend. Yeah. She just went away straight away. She was like, oh, Nissa and this, this, I saw this and this. And she was like, oh my God, these are my favourite chocolates. Spoke to her for about 10 minutes. Yeah. She was the nicest woman oh, ever. That's good. Because sometimes you hear the stories, you get in there, she's like, what do you Bring want? Bring me my coffee. Peasant. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're doing the live with me? Get out. <laughs> <laughs> she was so nice. She was literally, she was the nicest. She was like, I love what you're wearing. She was so, so nice. Yeah. Left after, like, I was like, I kind of was like, oh, I've got to go live in three minutes now. I've got to go. She was like, that's fine. Went downstairs. So the first half of the, this is what you're going to laugh at. I got there. I was so nervous. Yeah, I you. remember when you were just The reason words. I brought this up is because I was nervous. Yeah. That's why I kind of brought this up and changed the topic. Yeah, that makes about, sense. Changed this whole topic about me. No, but it Sorry. made me realise as well, like, I think my anxiety sometimes will mess me up in situations like that. I'll still do it. I need to like learn to get used to it, but like it kicked in so hard that I was there like yeah, trying yeah. to fight the shakes. It's so hard. Yeah. It's so difficult. And mine wasn't, yours is I feel like way more serious. I was about to say, I think yours would be harder because there's I more mean, people. I mean, you see the faces, yeah, maybe. Mine but I'd still be nervous in that situation. Mine was like, I was like, I cannot mess up. I have a film crew. So the guy came yeah, up to me. Scary. He was like, I'm just going to put this on, full on like film thingy, you Landmark, know. Yeah. You've, I don't know, you, yeah, yeah. you know about that stuff. And then I was like, okay, that's fine. I took my phone, connected it, came. Um, sat down, went live, and I was like, uh, there was like the whole, the thing that was scary is imagine this, and then you've just got everyone behind like watching, watching the whole set. The cameramen are like doing this, like, this. like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <They're running around>. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. But nothing's actually changing, but there are so yeah, many people yeah. like doing things. They're like, you're live, da, 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 and, and I'm just like, um, did they do the whole like five? Four, no. And then they go quiet. <laughs> no they didn't they were similar to that I'm not gonna lie and then I was just didn't know what to do I was like hi guys it's, I was like hi guys oh, I, I was see so the, like, nervous exact start. that must be funny oh, Eleanor guys, scream recorded all of a sudden I'm here guys my best friend scream recorded every second of it she's so cute two hours oh. of it on her phone oh that's so cute <laughs> Eleanor, she has no and you know she watches every single episode oh so, Ella, your G. <laughs> yeah um, anyway so that happened whatever and then and then Charlotte joins 30 minutes in right yeah. and this is what is so hilarious because um, she had to go and film she was only allowed to stay on there for about 30 minutes yeah. and she had to go film because she obviously had other work she's got other stuff to do yeah. and on the screen I was getting text messages from like um, my manager was it a saying, different phone? no it was someone else's phone yeah my manager saying um, I, she, I can she tell you to, had a phone that had like yeah. a little mirror in front of it so yeah. they can see so she needs to go film and her team her like maybe personal assistant and yeah. her like close team were kind of like and she was just like anyway so and she was enjoying herself so oh, much she and it like said she it on the screen it, yeah. on the screen it was like Charlotte you need to go film yeah. you have work to do like it's, it, you need to film and then my manager so her team were coming up to my manager and yeah. texting and saying can you tell her to try and get her off because yeah, yeah. she has to go film but it's so funny because like I feel like that's how I would be yeah I, she's just enjoying herself she's like <laughs> let me have this she's just so, like no. forget about that I'm enjoying this yeah. <laughs> she was enjoying the life so much and then people were writing and then my manager 
was sending her team was telling her what to tell me to say and it was like in brackets like so we enjoyed this so much but it is this time <laughs> they wanted you to and initiate Charlotte's her having to leave <laughs> I, they they kept saying it so i did i was like okay so charlotte it is actually eight o'clock and she goes i know what time it is darling and she oh, that's so <laughs> it's funny i don't i'm not angry i i, I mean i'm not like why would you be I mean, angry i'm not angry i'm not angry she told me she knows what time it no, is no i, I mean i'm up. not angry at my management yeah. for like telling me no, i mean i'm not angry at their the other team for telling me to try to get her off yeah. but I'm a bit like nervous no, I was a bit nervous because then you're going to have to tell her to do something she's going to be like shut but she no, knew that's what they were doing I was yeah. a bit nervous that I, I didn't want to come across like I was trying to get rid of her on the line yeah imagine so you're like yeah, it's time for you to go let me shine yeah <laughs> that's what I thought I would look like and oh. that's why I was a bit nervous but she's just she, she was just enjoying herself she seemed so nice on the she's, she's but I couldn't so, tell she was so nice I was like is she nice like behind the scenes as no, well no she is she's so yeah. and then apparently her team said that she after the live after she left um, she left and apparently she was like speaking about me for ages which was really cool yeah could, it could be a lie but yeah but I think she was impressed because you knew like they were getting a TikTok person to come do a live but did they know that you had a background in makeup because your TikTok is not about makeup you yeah. don't do makeup yeah I only, only sometimes so she must have enjoyed it because she was having an actual conversation with someone that kind of knows yeah. what they're on about and and you like were really good at like hyping up her products and all this stuff her product, you know what it is P- you I genuinely am yeah. not lying every single she you know I told you on my wedding day I was like I need the best makeup best skincare where am I gonna go I went into Charlotte yeah. Tilbury because she's known for having the best that's why people say that a lot of influencers don't like working with brands unless they really use it because it makes yeah. it 10 times easier yeah it does and personally I wouldn't um, also the next day um, sorry that's I'm right. just speaking about myself okay. sorry the next day um, I feel like maybe I shouldn't always share like the great things that happen in my yeah. life I know what you mean but I just feel like this is like a family and I know that you guys always make dua and say mashallah Allah verdict please do the next day I done another Black Friday live TikTok shopping live and I was like top seller in the whole of the UK that's and, so and Western Hemisphere Hemisphere Hemisphere, <laughs> hemisphere. <laughs> that's so sick mashallah so like Allah yeah which was really this. it was a really good basically week. we're giving away 50 airpods <laughs> and 20 iPhones <laughs> comment down below so guys please say Allah verdict <laughs> mashallah like I know I'm speaking about all these great things that are happening in my mm-hmm. life, but on the sideline, my mental health isn't that great. Yeah. I'm f- like things are, so it, like my career is going like this, but everything else is going, going down, down a bit. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm just trying to, ign- like I've got a lot going on, but uh, cause I've got- That so- kind of keeps you busy to what's going on yeah. down here. So like It's things, hard, isn't it? It's hard, but it's you know what? I wouldn't would change it for the world. Think, yeah, she's living. That's now, that's but how then we again, see celebrities. Allah, maybe Allah, sorry, not that you're sorry. a celebrity. Huh? Yeah, well, I was gonna say maybe Allah. I don't want. Uh, he says that Allah tests the ones He loves. Yeah. So I'd, I don't mind being tested with wanting to die every day. <laughs> no, stop Allah. <laughs> no, I don't mind being tested because it means that Allah loves me. Yeah. It, and then still everything's good in my life. Do you know what I mean? Because yeah. it could be worse. I could be depressed, that, and then and then, and then, and then yeah. everything else is bad. So I'm not gonna lie. If anything, I'm grateful for every. Like even if even if I had to stay in this position for the rest of my life, yeah. I'd still be so grateful. That's sick. And I'm proud of you as well. Thank you. Um, back to what the event thing I was talking oh, about. Oh, sorry. That's no, all right. I've only got a little bit to say. There's not much that <laughs> went on. I'm so bad. No, I was like, mind. attention <laughs> on you anyway. <laughs> no, mine, it was only a small bit anyway. Well done. I really want. I really wish I went. Um, and what's funny is this. Not funny, sorry. What was nice is when it ended, this is why I can't wait for the meet and greet because it's going to be such a nice experience. People coming up to me, they're young, like younger kids and they're like, oh, thank you for that talk. It was so inspirational. Aww. And I was like, about to cry yeah, like, oh, that's so nice thank you, Are you uh, <laughs> so the cute. best feeling in the world is it not me meeting the podcast yes that's years? why I'm not actually after that day I was thinking when we do our meet like, I think it's going to be one of my favourite days ever it's going to imagine no one shows up but no I'm, there's a part of me that thinks you don't understand will. not loads but like a good when amount. I meet people that listen to the podcast mm. I just feel like I'm with family yeah. w- wallah that's so sick. this is why I'm, I'm. it's nothing I'm so excited for that meet and greet yeah. I'm so excited I've learned that I'm just Maybe I am a bit socially awkward. I don't think you are. I'm not. But it depends on the situation. Like sometimes I can come in and it, it's what my body decides whether today's going to be a good day or a bad day. Like I'll, I'll go into a situation, I'm fully confident or sometimes I'll go into a situation and it just leaves my body. I'm like, I don't know what to do or say. Um, you're right there. You're not even thinking. Are you? No, I am. Sorry. You see, my brain just like wanders yeah, off. because it's not about you and Charlotte Tilbury. We get it. It's true. No, I was thinking about something else. Wallah. What were you thinking about? Turn it off. Who is yeah. it? 
Ivan's calling me. Love you, Ivan. If you're watching this, you're FaceTiming me and I couldn't pick up because of the podcast. Does he watch a podcast? <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't zoning out of what you said. I was thinking about something else in no, my that's brain. that's right. I get it. Don't worry. Anyway, guys, remember last episode we were doing assumptions and then we had some would you rather. So I think we should carry them on. And yeah, let's get to it, girl. You lot went ham with these would you rather. They're hard? so funny. All right, go on then. We got it. Okay, let's just do would you rather because we haven't done this in a long time as well. Okay, so would you rather elbow drop your nan or go to prison for 15 years oh my, na- my nan's I'm gonna, getting yeah, it yes yeah. i'm gonna realize you're gonna have to hold that mama. <laughs> <laughs> i think she could take it obviously <laughs> no, she would want to take I, it as at well. that age no come they on smack, they pop a hip they're done no <laughs> Do no 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 because no. women's mashallah women's not like like fragile, fragile. she's like she does she goes shopping she but like it, lifts things yeah, she does because she's like she lives on her, on her ones isn't it so she's more of like a yeah. Go, she can do it all on her ones. Yeah, yeah, it. yeah. yeah we'll probably elbow drop her. She'll go this. <laughs> do it again. Headbutt back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't lie. My nan's getting 50, it. Yeah, I'm not allowed to do 15 what years. What the hell? Even if it was a one year, I'd tell you. That's it. I'd elbow drop her in two weeks. <laughs> Even if it was a day. <laughs> <laughs> Even if I had to walk past the prison, I'd elbow drop her. <laughs> 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 that was too far. That was too far. <laughs> Even if I had to have a phone call with yeah. a prisoner, <laughs> that's deep. Even if I had to dream about prison. No, <laughs> oh, that was funny. Okay, yeah, not gonna lie. Um, that, that was a that was a good one, but like a bit of a silly one at the same no, time. That was funny. <laughs> okay, would you rather pee glass or poop blades? <laughs> oh, wait, <laughs> wait. The poop blades. I can imagine I that like and it, it would, would it I hurt. Feel like the, no, I feel like wait, the poo wait. would uh, would like hold the no, blades. No, is it just blades? Oh then? yeah, I didn't think. Of that. <laughs> 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 thought there was a mixture. You know, like in America, the nutters put like the blades in chocolate <laughs> candy. You that. thought it was gonna come out like that? <laughs> I didn't think no, that. I'm, I and it, the pea glass. Like, how does that work? Little, Shards of no, glass. No, 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 like little cut. But then glass. would it hurt? Well, obviously, is it just pure glass or does the pee come out with it? There That's you go. what I mean. That's what I'm saying. It was with. I think with it. I think poop. I feel like. I feel like because I feel like the other area is a bit more sensitive. Yeah, yeah. Bum holes can take it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, moving on. Yeah, definitely poop. <laughs> I, um, <laughs> yeah so would you i think we've got this before but would you want to know how you died or when you die um i'd rather how? know when no what i've said this before but why would you know how if they say all right you drown that just means you're gonna be so scared to swim ever again in your life but imagine you're not gonna die until you're 150 so you yeah, would but just imagine stop, you find out you're so gonna you, die no, in you like just stop two swimming. days okay actually to be fair islamically i'd rather know when yeah but not just that just think about it you stop yourself from doing a certain thing because you think you're just how you're gonna die, but you imagine it's not for years and years. Mm. Do you know what I mean? I think you're right as so well. I'd rather know when. I'd rather know when. Yeah, definitely. definitely but um, how right. sad would that be if they were like, so, well, you "Just do you know when you're gonna die," and I'm, you're like, "Yeah," and they're like, "One, <laughs> one what? No, no, I did it wrong. You did it I'm wrong. I'm so sorry, I did it wrong. Ten, 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 mo- ten months, ten years. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> eight. eight. <laughs> ten <times laughs> I messed up the joke. Oh, you messed up the joke. That was a hilarious one oh, as well. Thanks. Okay, so would you rather have 150 grand today or 10 million in 15 years? 10 million in 15 years. Yeah, I reckon. So I don't mind just living how you're living now. Living how I'm living now. Even if for the next 15 years I'm just struggling, knowing that in 15 years I'm going to be up 10 million. Yeah, yeah. 150, I'll spend that quick, man. It'll be yeah, gone. Yeah, I'd do the 15. I mean, I'd, I could invest it into stuff, but it's just longer. Like, I'd rather, because yeah. you never know. Who says I'm not going to make that money? And before you can I hit, live how, you can live how you're living anyway. If I get 10 anyway. million by the time I hit in 15 years, in then I just get another 10 million on top. Yeah. Woo. Definitely take the 10 million in 15 years. Okay, this is a good one. Cheat on your partner. Partner. Par- <laughs> cheat on your partner. Watch your partner cheat on you. I'm cheating. We've done this one before, but I no. What the hell? I, did we say this last time? Yeah, I think I'd watch my partner cheat on me. That's so weird. Because Eeyore. then at least I know no. my more, no, no. It's not weird. Because at least it's weird. No, it's I'm not. Sorry. Because at least. Get off. <laughs> what do you mean? You're the weird though. That's weird. No, your partner should be worried. Um, I would rather have the moral. And he wants to be the good yes. person in the situation. So I know that I never, it wasn't me that did something wrong. Who cares? That's someone gave them. you an option. That's their sin. Yeah, but someone gave you an option. Yeah, and I chose to be the good one. So I can go to the next relationship and be like, I have trust issues. You have <laughs> I know, I got cheated. <laughs> nah, I'm, don't, I'm not going to lie. I'd rather cheat than, than watch myself, my partner cheat on me. Right. Yeah, but you're mentally ill, so it makes sense. Would, 
<laughs> Sorry, that was a low blow. Um, would you rather marry someone that's poor but loves you and rich and doesn't care for you? This poor. is so. <laughs> Obviously, rich and doesn't care for me. <laughs> this is so, this is so funny because what psychopath would say rich and doesn't care for me? There is that. Though. That does happen. Yeah, and they're psychotic gold diggers. No, they're rich and they don't care about you. Yeah. I would rather someone poor, but they love me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, yeah, same. But who no, would turn around and say, "Nah, rich"? I don't care if they oh, don't yeah. like oh, me. Oh yeah, oh, there they go, digger. Yeah, yeah, I get yeah, what you exactly. Mean. Yeah. Um, give me my yeah, red bag this. with my makeup. Have you seen that? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> I wish. It sounds so funny. I wish I knew. I'm gonna get it, Ayub. <laughs> oh, here we go. Have it you, do you guys funny. know what it is? <laughs> Okay, so basically this girl, he's rich mm. and she's like his girl. It's like a TV program. It might be Night and Day Fiance, but he's like, I don't know if it is. So she's he's, a rich one. He's rich. Oh, he's rich. And she like uses his money and okay, stuff. And this is how she treats him. Hey. What? I'm going to get her wallet. Bring me my red bag with my makeup. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know. I've seen it. I've seen it. <laughs> And she just treats him like absolute like crap but the what? whole episode. I'm sorry, you're rich. You can find someone nicer. I know, but that's what I mean. He's obviously insecure. But that would be me, guys. Give me my... Who, hey, <laughs> who understood the meme before someone I loved. showed someone it? Loved. Who laughed? Someone. <laughs> just not, not any not of our you. viewers. <laughs> wow. Do I have a bogey? Yeah. No, you don't. Okay. Would you rather go traveling for six months or travel three times throughout the year? Sorry, I thought you were going to hit me. Um, traveling for six months, I feel like <laughs> would... Headache. No, I think I I feel like I need it. No, nah, I'd do this three times six. I'd do the th- three times six. I'd do the three <laughs> times throughout the year, man. Just go on holiday, come no, back. No, but I feel like it would be nice to have really. How long was it? Six months. Yeah, nah. It feels a bit long with maybe four months, but it would be nice to t- imagine to take a break. Just go see yeah, the world. Yeah, but why don't you have three different breaks? And then that how way long you can come and sort your sort your stuff out. How long out. are the breaks? Let's say like. Not long enough. Two and a half weeks. No, it'd have to be a month each time. No, because that just defeats... No, then why am I going to go two and a half weeks when I could travel the world and constantly visit different countries for six months? That'd be so sick. Mm, true. People go I, I honestly wouldn't because I have an issue when it comes to change and I'd rather like be in my own space, the come is, home, that's pack me my as, stuff, But that's me as well, do this. Don't forget, I, yeah. I don't even sleep anywhere else, but I feel like right now, especially in this time in my life, I feel like I'd need like I'd, a good four months at least of just going do somewhere it then. and just traveling the world. I can't... Because it costs money. And it only costs money because I'm not staying in some hostel with a random bunch of people. Like, I if feel I'm like that's so fun I wanna, No, I'm, I would do... I don't know. I'm too OCD. Like, let me have some luxury, please. Yeah, true. Um, I mean, I'd still... I can see myself Would you rather it, be right? invisible or be able to read people's minds? I'm already an overthinker. So if I just knew what you were thinking, it would stress me yeah, out. Yeah, <laughs> imagine you meet someone. Hi, oh, this guy's so ugly. I don't care about the ugly thing, but if they're no, just but, like... No, oh, but his breath stinks. Yeah, I'd like be in the corner of the room. Stop. (laughs) I'd rather be invisible because then you can like go into a bank and... It's even worse though. Then you get to walk in and hear people talking about you. Oh yeah, (laughs) it's the same thing. (laughs) Do you know what? At least when you're invisible, you smack the head out of them once they're talking. They'll be like, yeah, so that guy, hey, you guys, really... No, I'm thinking about the money, (laughs) Ayo. I'd love to be invisible. Imagine just being a fly on the wall. But imagine like, you can be invisible. In, beyond, in Kim but, Kardashian's dresser. But do you know what would be fun? If you could like make... Oh, that was a bit weird. Why would you want to be there? So you can see her naked. You catch me there with you. <laughs> I'm like, whoa. <laughs> no, but imagine... You could go on flight. Imagine if you could make someone you invisible could, with you though. Oh yeah, by That'd touching them. That'd be fine. Them. So that, but then, and then when you let go, they have like an hour of invisibility. But imagine no, you no, split no, up. No, no. They need you still there. It'd have to be when, as soon as you let go of them, they can be seen. Oh, I'd, I'd, I'd grab so onto someone take them kidnap them take them so- why am I thinking you can tra- travel as well yeah no. that would be way better I'd rather yeah. be travelling mm, I'd rather I teleportation feel like I'd rather be invisible because no, you can just get a train in- no are you mad listen teleportation as <laughs> soon as we're done here that's it I'm in a different country I'm chilling go here go there like that is so sick <laughs> okay so would you rather be in a zombie apocalypse or a robot apocalypse a zombie Zom- obviously Zom- oh my god it's robot. literally been a what's dream. the satisfaction of that that's yeah. so dead I've literally ew. we've spoken about this before but I would I love, it. love I would love they're my favourite movies yeah but walking watch. dead zombies not yeah yeah not the world fuck. war z oh my god yeah. or no, like no, no. I am legend no no not that's them scary. ones but the you need the slow dead. ones that you can just like they yeah. walk up to you, all you have to do is turn your body a little bit and yeah. then Yeah, <laughs> and then they fall. Yeah. Nah, the Walking Dead zombies. But if they were like the other ones, nah, I wouldn't be able to have I haven't watched The Walking Dead, but to me, it's, it's, I feel like it's, it's so funny. Good. Because 
all the zombies are slow. How is anyone dying? Nah, this are is they how like they on die. the phone and Some, they accidentally get They're caught. not all really slow. Sometimes like when there's loads of them and they're all like, yeah. like it's, it's mainly it's, when there's a lot of them. It's not when oh, there's just okay. one of them. And I'm guessing when there's a lot of them, they still have, human, they still have human speed. Like they're still fast enough. Yeah, so yeah, it's, yeah. You're not, no one's really fast enough to dodge a human yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, loads, yeah, especially exactly. if there's loads of them. Okay, that makes sense. And it, so, when I say loads of them, I literally mean like hundreds of thousands sometimes. Yeah, that's, oh, that's mad. Yeah, but I'd like I would I'd go around looking through people's pockets. You weirdo. No, just because the you world's have... coming to an end, mate. You don't need money. Not money. <laughs> not girl, not about money. She's hungry for money. Not about money. I just want to know like who this What's person this? was. What I'd look at their ID. I'd look at like maybe yeah. if they had car keys. I would or... I would find it fun doing the whole building my own f- like yeah, structural place. Or, like, or, like, yeah, but how are you gonna do it? You have set... no idea. I do. I know how to do it. How? I swear. <laughs> um, I'll just call Bubba. He knows how to do that stuff. <laughs> you can't call that line. Um, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> low blow. That's my second low blow of this episode. I'll take it back. No, no, not again. Please. <laughs> You're lucky. <laughs> anyway, yeah. I think that would be the fun part of it. Like, getting a car and armoring it up and then getting the weapons. And I think, <laughs> yeah. It would be so fun to just start your own town. Yeah. Like, Do you know what you're saying? This Recently, I've been having dreams of being chased by, like, a murderer. You shouldn't say your no, bad wait, dreams. Wait, explain, no, but, but you shouldn't say your bad dreams. They don't turn bad. Dreams. They turn good. It's, not, it's gonna be weird. Let me explain. And then you at got first, a bogey. get it for me. No. <laughs> Where is it there? Hey, you. Is it gone? Look up. Yeah. Anyway, so I'm first. I'm getting chased, and it's a bit like scary. And I'm running. I'm like, it's like real, very real, but like horror movie real. And then all of a sudden, the tables turn, and like I'll end up hitting him. He drops, and I take the weapon off him, and then I end up killing him. Hey, if this is a bad dream that you yeah, shouldn't say. Yeah, but I'm say. enjoying it. It's not bad. No, that doesn't matter if you're enjoying it or <laughs> that not. That's because so you're a psychopath. You no, shouldn't say fun. bad. It becomes fun, and I'm like no, no, no. free running, and I'm like Look, able to like do. You shouldn't things. say bad dreams. Oh, when bad things happen, they're the shaitan. Any bad dreams. Okay, but it was enjoyable because they're from the shaitan. The yeah, good dream. Do you think that? To me, that was a good dream. You think, but that, I know dream, what you mean. You think that dream was from Allah? <laughs> they no. say the good dreams oh, yeah. are from Allah. True, true. And the well, bad, I don't know. Maybe he was trying to give me to some To be fair, they say there's three types of dreams. Correct me if I'm wrong. The bad dreams from Shaitan, the ones from Allah, the good dreams, and the ones just from your mind. Yeah, so maybe that was just from my mind. Yeah, but maybe like still bad. Do you know why I, do you know why I think? And you shouldn't say that because they can harm but you. But do you know why I think I've been dreaming them? Because I was watching you. Oh, and like there was kidnapping it. and there was stuff like that. And got, oh, and not to mention kidnapping. Yeah, I saw your TikTok. you see my TikTok? Do you think that's a good fit? Did you a get any? Fit? How many views did you get? Like I'm not. I don't I care about well. the views, but yeah, I'm saying God, people. The, not that I care, but because I want to see how relatable it is. Yeah, I think a lot. Because when you get a lot of views, it means it's more relatable. And I was really curious to see who would relate yeah, to that. Yeah. So basically, the TikTok was. I was talking about a fear that I have within a fear. So I, I feel like a lot of people have the fear of being like kidnapped, like or have feared it once upon a time, or they still do. But my fear is not the actual kidnapping. It's during the kidnapping. You know when they like tie you up with a duct tape you or they'll duct tape your mouth. Like what happens if you get a blocked nose whilst they've like gagged your mouth and everything? Yeah. And then you die. You're just done. And then what if they weren't... In- you're down. <laughs> and what if their intention wasn't to kill you? Yeah. Like they'd all just like... So imagine you you kidnap someone. You're like, I'm not going to kill him, but we have to kidnap him to do this and we'll, we'll take him back afterwards. Yeah. Or but you then, have like, a panic. Or yeah. you start having a panic attack. And then attack. he's in the back or of the car. And he, yeah, he just dies because he can't breathe. Yeah. And then you're like, now you've got a whole murder. You're going to go for five years. Now you're in yeah, for life. Yeah, that is true. I think about that. <laughs> to be fair. I think about that. I would actually, oh, this is so bad. But someone commented, apparently, sorry to cut you off. Apparently your body knows when you can't breathe and you've got blocked nose and it, there's no oxygen going into your body. Your body has a way of like. How? Because it's just blocked. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But someone commented saying your body will find a way of freeing up your airways from your nose. But to me, it was confusing because all that mucus is just going to slide out. Like yeah. I've got issues as well. It's like. Don't do that. Anyway, yeah. So, um, Why what, did you what were you gonna say? Like what were you gonna say? You just went. I do it a lot. I don't know why. I do this yeah, thing. Went, like, I pretend you, to you like look like, you up and down or like give you like a. But it's not. I don't actually care. I'm just doing it for the bands. What are you thinking about while you've done it? <laughs> the smell of my breath on this mic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> That's buttons. Can you smell nice. your breath? I can't, like smell any, I can't smell anything. I'm joking. I can't smell anything. Either. Say Allah. Well, well, Let me smell you. That's a bit dirt. It's gone, <laughs> That's so dirt. I don't want to smell yours. What the hell? Breath. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'll cut that. Are you just being so rude today? We didn't have to cut out so much stuff. No, we two things that we're going to cut out. And it wasn't the first one. Wasn't rude. I'm just done. <clears throat> You're down. Don't try it. I can see you trying to flick your trinket at me. All right, let's do another assumption. And then, um, yeah. No, I'm not done. 
Okay, would you rather stop being a waste man or stop being a waste man? Um, both. Okay, would you have rather have more time or more money? <clears throat> more time. More time. I feel like create more memories. Why do people actually, glamorize no, I don't know money I want, so I don't know if I want more time, actually. I'd rather more money. Because actually, more then you time, can live the like, time. I'm not, I'm not going to lie to you. I don't want to be here Yeah, long. who wants to be alive? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I think quite a lot but of us. But no, you'd rather have a it's quality yeah. over quantity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so, I'm not trying to be here for long. There's no, I don't really enjoy this world. And you can help more people. I can help people do things. To be things. fair, I'd have more money. Like, I'm the type of person who well, so I will make dua that Allah takes me as soon as he's happy with me. Yeah. I don't mind if if, if he's if God is happy, Allah is happy with me now, take me now. I'd rather go and be in heaven. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I yeah. don't, there's nothing like... And you then you can help people, sense? you can start charities, you can yeah. open... like. Why do we always mosques? think that you have to have money to start charities? You know we could start a charity No, I know, but what I'm saying is, from. let's say you are a millionaire, you yeah. can just open an orphanage Nishun, just uh, with your own money. Back to what I was saying before about the... I realised I was passionate talking about mental health. I really want us to do something with mental health, like start an organisation yeah, or do something towards it. Yeah, let's fix our own first before we worry about everyone else. <laughs> what? That was so rude. <laughs> no, what I mean is, no, we don't should we fi- really be giving mental health advice? Not health advice, but we start, start an organisation or helps- foundation that helps people with mental health. How do we go so about that? I don't know, we'll figure it out. There might be someone who works for charity here. Do you know what I mean? So, and it could be the f- so Sally Rabel Foundation. So maybe we can raise money. Sally Rabel Foundation. Ma- yeah, that would look so good on my skin. <laughs> oh my God. That was funny. Listen, maybe we can raise money to start an organisation that could have therapists for people. Yeah. Like that. Is that what you mean? Something like that. It just it provides, provides information and advice for Not people that need help. Not just information. Someone to talk to, someone to actually... Yeah, exactly, someone to speak maybe to. Maybe we can fund therapy. Because a lot of, I, feel like NH- I feel like NHS therapy NHS. is not that good. Mm, yeah. I mean, it's you've just been a waiting list. It. The waiting list is very long, and I done it when I was very young, so I don't know. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. Like, maybe we could do something. Or that just someone to makes talk it easier. to. Yeah. And um, yeah, that's a very good idea. Inshallah, one day. Inshallah. Or um, someone's <coughs> taking it from you guys. Um, us. Yeah. So, would you rather live with your parents for the rest of your lives or live with your siblings? I'd live with my mum. I'd do both, but I'd like rather my mum. I'd rather my mum as well because everyone it's normal like even the whole Asian community they always live with their mums yeah. anyway I feel like it would be more conflict if I lived with you yeah or I'd rather Sammy. live with my mum yeah I feel like if I lived with you or Sammy it would be because way more conflict we, well okay but I heard you the first time but why if I live with you or something no, I'm joking uh, not just that because I feel like we're, we're we're still growing adults especially Sammy like, and he's, we're gonna have our he's own still kid. growing whereas with with like if mum lived with us whatever she would be like the grandma yeah, that's there and, and it's she'd, nice she'd probably, if anything probably be more helpful yeah I definitely live with my mum Sammy if you're watching this I know he doesn't watch I love you bro okay would you rather kill all of your friends or one family member all of my this friends this one's so good really yeah all of my friends, you can hold that quick. I don't even, I, not even, not even for a family member. I just do it for fun. No, nah, I'm joking. I think maybe a family, I've got a family member I could get rid of. But when I say family member, I mean the top five top closest five. family members. No. And then you, but you have to kill all, every single one of your friends. Top five closest family. Obviously, I'm dead off all my friends. So you'd kill like 10, 15 people. Over I don't f- even have 10, 15 people now, oh. Jake. Now I do. But I would, yeah, over my top family members. What? You, Semi, Mum. Wow. And obviously the others, but what is it, top three or what? That's a top five. Oh, top five. <laughs> then there's, there's other honourable mentions as well. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't know what I would do. I'd probably, I don't know. Top five, I'd have to kill my friends. I'm so sorry, guys. Yeah, obviously. I'm so sorry. Which sorry, I can't like they're going to pick you. Nisha, Nisha thinks in her head that her friends would have saved her over their top five. And that's why she's saying sorry. Sorry, guys. Like, I would have done the same that you did yeah. for me, but top I can't. Top five. Okay, maybe top ten. I, I'd I'd think about it. What about all-time family members? You oh, have yeah, to kill no, 15 family members or 15 n- friends. No, obviously... I don't know. I, I could feel like I could get I rid could of... Get there's 15 family members that we don't even speak to anymore. Yeah, I'd get rid of... Not, out of, like, rid of not out of falling out with them, but... Now, nah, listen, you, you kill about, five like, family all... members or... I don't have 15 friends. I've literally got three. Oh, that's cute. Five family members mm-hmm. to save three of your friends, but they can be any family members. Yeah, yeah, that's easy. Yeah, I'd There's do family that. members that... Not that have any... We don't fall out... I haven't fallen out with anyone in my family, but there's family members that we just haven't seen in like a year. And we've got cousins and cousins and cousins and yeah, cousins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I always get them ones that like message me on the DM, like, I'm your cousin, this is from here. I'm like, oh, And I'm okay. like, I don't know you. You're on the first list. <laughs> first yeah, on the list it? to go. Um, yeah, no, I definitely... But the first... The top five family members, I'd have to dead off my friends. But if it was like anyone else, I'd, I'd definitely save them. Okay, cute. Yeah.
All right, guys. So we're now jumping into the cool segment. But before we do that, you thought we forgot, but we did. We almost did forget. Yeah, we almost did forget. <laughs> we're going to give you the word for the giveaway that we mentioned at the start of the Say, video. If you want to win some AirPods for our one year giveaway. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's not a big deal. We could have done way more, but it's just like what we could do quickly. Yeah. Don't worry, guys. We'll have more of these, inshallah, throughout the year. Definitely. But if you want to wear, win a pair of AirPods, um, then all you have to do is comment down below your favorite part of the podcast. Or if you don't have a favorite, you can't remember, just comment when you started watching us. Yeah. And then right at the end. No, actually. What? Right in the middle, right? Not in the middle, just at the end. Okay, right at the end. I was going to say middle no, so we'll make people it more clear. don't know. Yeah, because you could put it in. At this right episode, at, the, at this minute. <laughs> yeah, right at the end, put the number. Not the number. The letter. What? Let the me word. You're struggling. The word six. So S-I-X. Six for the 6th of December, which is the date that we first posted our first episode. So whatever you write in your comment section, as long as you put six at the end with a love heart. You will be um, entering the giveaway. And we'll pick the winner in the next episode. So literally in a week. Actually, what episode is this, Ayub? Um, 48. 48? Yeah. 48 you sure? Or, yeah, 48 or 49. I think it's 48. Okay. So yeah, we'll pick the episode, the winner in the next um, episode. Get your phone out. We're going to yeah. go on to the cool segment. My oh, favorite yeah, part. Go. Um, yeah. Okay, don't say it too out loud. Ready? Let me suck your titties, baby. Didn't you screen record it? Yeah. Okay, let me see. Zero, zero. I'm excited. Hopefully it goes well. Sula. No, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I was struggling there. <laughs> I was just going to say My mind went blank. Yeah, that's it. Are you ready, kids? Oh, yeah, I, I want to speak first. You always speak first. Because they don't know me. Make it funny. When you speak, they know you. Hi there, their name's Patty. Um, I called three times wondering um, when you'd get back to me. Sorry? The name's Patty. I called three times wondering when you'd get back to me. Ignore him. Hi! Hi. It's Nisrin. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> oh. We're on the podcast. <laughs> my accent was so terrible. <laughs> God, I didn't even recognize that. <laughs> His accent was so bad. Was it bad? I, do you know what? I could do it normally good, but oh under God, pressure. I don't know if you guys are calling me. Yeah, we wanted to. We basically just saw your DM, and we were like, "Yeah, let's give her a call." Sorry, we didn't reply to it. I literally just saw it now. Um, but yeah, we thought we'd give you a call and see how you're doing. Oh my God, I'm fine. How are you guys? Hamdulillah, we're good. How's life? It's alright. <laughs> No, yeah. I can't believe you guys called me. I'm still shocked. Oh. Honestly, we just wanted to make your day better because I did see the DM and I will reply to you after this because obviously we're filming a podcast right now. I don't want to go into too many details. But yeah, we just wanted to make sure that you're okay, let you know that you're strong, let you know that Allah tests the ones that he loves. So he must love you a lot. Oh my God, oh my God, I love your podcast. Oh. We want to say as well that we appreciate you a lot. Well, uh, like... It's people like you that support us that like get us through our days and our lives and things that we go through. So we really appreciate you. Oh, okay. Well, um, my sister loves you guys. Where is she? Yeah, bring. Yeah, don't tell her. her. Don't tell her it's us though. Let's prank her. Oh, <laughs> uh, you did the prank this time because I was terrible. <laughs> guys, I promise I'm normally good at the accent, but I was under pressure. Hello. Is, um, Hi, um, me and your sister are arguing. Yeah. And like, I just wanted to know if you could give me her address so I could come to your house and speak to her properly. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> That's so deep. <laughs> Hi, <Hey>, it's... <laughs> it's this, Rin. Hi. <laughs> How are you? How are you? Oh, you sound really young. How old are you? 16. Oh. <laughs> I thought so you were the older sister. I thought you were the older sister. I thought you were older. That's why I pranked you. It's all right. Oh, oh you that's... sound so cute. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sorry for pranking you. I thought you were a lot. <laughs> it's fine. Right. so shy right now. Hey, you're my best <laughs> Oh, Hi, guys. How are you? Hi, little bud. 
my sister's like your biggest fan. Oh, <laughs> like, I'm dying right now. Really? That's so cute. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> we, well, we hope you guys are well. Like, I just honestly, I hope you're well. How are things? How's life? Yeah, it's all right now. It's a bit better. I'm in my final year of uni, so I'm just. Oh, um, are you enjoying it? Sorry, I pranked your sister. I thought she was older than you. It's fine, no. She was so confused. I bet she was like, um, why is she trying to get me involved? <laughs> um, oh, but that's so cute. Oh in sh- do, where do you live? Do you live in London? Yeah, we live in East London. Wait, so if we do our meet and greet, do you think you and your sister would come? Yeah, definitely. Oh, that's oh that's you know so what? Sick. That would make me so happy. I really, I really make dua that we can do that. Inshallah. Inshallah. But oh my god, I literally, I was just thinking, what day is it? You guys gonna um, post your podcast? But I realized it's not even Sunday. I was just waiting for it. Oh, oh that's thank so you so much, <laughs> Queen. Oh, oh, this is oh so wholesome. God, we, actually, Oh my god, I'm actually so shocked. I, would, I didn't even expect it. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> I'm so gassed. This is our longest phone call, to be fair, because yeah. we're enjoying it. Yeah. Um, but what's your name? Sorry, we never. You don't mind your name being um oh. on the podcast, do you? No, I don't mind. It's Naima. Naima, okay. Naima, it was so nice speaking to you. I really pray that I can meet you one day, inshallah, and speak inshallah. to you and your sister. I hope so too, inshallah. Can, can we oh say god. bye to her? Yeah, I'm also going to be scared. <laughs> Oh. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi, we're going now, but it was so nice speaking to you. It was nice speaking to you too. All right, take care, beautiful. You too. Bye. 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 Oh, she's so cute. Oh. Why did I prank? Oh, she hung up. I don't think she meant to hang up. This room. We didn't say bye to the girl properly. I know, but listen. Did you hang up? No, I didn't, Wallah. She hung up. Ring her back, ring her back. Because it might have been a little sister that hung up. And I want to say bye to her properly. Go on then. Do you know what I mean? We just, I didn't say bye to her properly. Why did you prank? She was like a little girl. (laughs) You're not with this this room. What a bully. (laughs) Hello? Hi, we didn't say bye properly, so we thought we'd just ring you back Uh, and say bye. Oh, sorry, she ended it. Yeah, Yeah, I knew she ended it. I told you, Amy. You're thinking, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh no, you didn't let me finish. Oh, I told you. Yeah, this is smart. She clocked um, into that. <laughs> yeah, I thought. I honestly, that's what I thought happened. But yeah, no, I just wanted to say we love you and inshallah we see you soon. And yeah, we appreciate you. No, we... I love you too. Thank you guys so much for meeting me. It's okay, Queen. I hope you have an amazing rest of your night. And thank you for supporting us. You too, both of you. Love you. Hope you and your family are well. Love you, you too. Oh, I hope your mum's well as well. Oh, oh thank, thank you. you so much. I appreciate that. We love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> that's so oh, cute. I'm be, clever. You just did yeah, a smart. Also, you just threatened her sister. <laughs> Not threatened her, but like... That was so bad. <laughs> she was like... <laughs> I thought she was an older sister. Yeah, for, uh, well, like, in my head, she I was sounded like, oh, young yeah. herself. In my head, I was like, oh, she's going to an older sister. Damn it. That's so jokes. <laughs> she was like... Damn it, I'm, I'm, I'm actually messed up. That's so jokes. Anyway, guys, um, we're going to do the shout-out of the week. And, um, oh, that yeah. was so wholesome. <laughs> that was so cute. Like, I really enjoyed the cool segment. I'm so happy that's, like, become part of it. Yeah, <laughs> that honestly makes my life. Oh. Um, okay, so the shout hey, we need to start shouting out people that we haven't, that yeah. have been commenting. Okay, okay. Screenshot it as well. Oh, okay. So, so the shower go. The shower of the week goes to Hajj. So her name is Hajj. I just think that's how you spell it. She's a very, very beautiful girl, mashallah. And she said, "Bro, no one understands my love for this podcast. My favorite notification, wallah, feels like my family at this point. Um, I'm gonna start telling people you're my older siblings. Oh, oh that's so cute. We Thank are you, your family. We are. I think I don't know if that's how you spell it. Hajj. Her her, her, her name's probably Hajar. Yeah. Maybe in like a second. And she's put hush. But we appreciate Thank you. you. Thank you. We and we are you. family. You, are, you guys we are, are family, your Allah. older siblings. Listen, as well, like if you see us in person again, don't be shy. Talk to us You're like you know family. us. family. We're here for you. We love you. But yeah, Nishan. And- yeah, thank you guys for one year of one the podcast. One year. Oh, God, I'm not forgetting. High five. We should we get each other one year present. We should. 
buy me something now. Or we should put a PO box in. You guys get us one. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> okay, all right. Yeah. Um, but yeah, guys, we appreciate you. We love you guys so much. It's been one and year. And thank you to the girl for the who sh- who we just done a shout again. Yeah. we love you. We, we love are you. your family. You are our family. I do want to say though, like you. we keep you guys in our prayers. Like we make do for you guys, and I know you guys have always got us in your prayers. Like we appreciate you lot so much. Well, like it's actually been one year. Like it's a whole year journey, and it, it's just a start. It's of like this, yeah, and it, and Shadow like just a start, and it's gonna be much more. We're gonna hold events. We're gonna do a lot of stuff. The battery's gonna die. Hurry up. Just it's not. Just <laughs> oh, to you get, changed it. Yeah, yeah, I changed it. Oh yeah, why am I just rushing? Yeah, put your hand down, G. Sorry, anyway, the battery dies as, after an hour. So. As I was saying, guys, there's gonna be way more events, and I feel like we're gonna do as much as we can to get interactive with our audience and just it's like Allah. make you look actually feel. Because I know we're we're bad at replying. I'm bad at replying, but I want to do more things so that you look can get a full experience of like being part of. Our one family. big family and yeah, not, just, not just, like just like watching us through a screen yeah exactly inshallah but yeah guys uh, we love you and yeah Nishan where can I find you you can find me smiling on my pillow cause it's one year Ooh. anniversary you always forget to actually give your app. oh you can find me <laughs> at it's Nisrin on Instagram and TikTok you can find me at Kelly Kesha on all social media platforms don't forget to follow Sadly Relatable Podcast on Instagram and TikTok guys we love you guys so much thank you for supporting us for a whole year you guys have changed our lives we love you so much and we will be here next week inshallah love you um, guys yeah see ya peace bye